In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to set up a new master page in Quark Express. First, file new and project, and make sure all your settings of your book are correct. This is the size I want the uh, book to be. And of course, check out the margin guides. Okay, and the gutter width, everything is fine. And I'm going to go for the automatic text box. Okay click in. Now to bring this page uh, into the center of your screen click on the Alt key and it should bring up the hand and just drag with the left mouse click and bring it into a better view. Okay I'm going to move this slightly a little bit here and I'm going to set up the master page. Now the master page is where you will put the uh, the, the heading of each page and the page count which will change from page 1 to 2 to 3 and so on and so on and without a master page your book is really going to be oh a lot of work so get the master page sorted first and everything will take care of itself okay this is the master page here double click Again, Alt key, bring the hand in, left mouse click, and we're going to write uh, for each page we want the same. So we're going to rectangle text box tool and draw in here, and we're going to put um, my book title here. Okay, and we're going to center it. I'm not going to worry about the style sheets at the moment. I'm just going to show you how to make a master page. And I'm going to forget about the fonts also. And what we want to do here as well is put in a current page box. Okay, on the rectangular tool again. Text tool. And we're going to draw here and we're going to go straight up to utilities insert character and special characters in brackets breaking scroll down to current page box as you will see this little sign here the number sign enclosed in the two crocodile brackets forget the font at the moment you can change that later on and we're going to center it now this is the title of the book here you can put in whatever your book title is. Make sure it's centered and you're happy with it. You're happy with the font. And then we are going to go to the first page. You cannot write anything inside. As you can see, I'm trying to paste something. You cannot do anything with text or anything in the master. You don't want to touch the master anyway. But the automatic text box on a master page cannot contain text. That's very clear. What we do is go to the first page, and as you can see, this is page one. The master is already put in, and of course, page one. Now I'm going to put in uh, some text here, and it's going to automatically go to the next page, which is page two. Still with the title of my book here, and when I keep writing, obviously I'm just pasting here automatic uh, Latin text it's going to go straight down all the way page 3 still with the book title here page 4 page 5 and so on and so on now if I want to change anything in the title here I just go to the master and in here I'm going to just put something different. Let's put capital letters, change my book title here and you will see the master has changed everything, change my book title here it's the same in page 1 as it is in page 2, page 3 
and so on and so on. So if you have 300 pages, you don't actually have to physically go in 300 times and change the title. And that's how you set up a master page in Quark Express. Now this is a very, very basic, uh, you know, tutorial, but it is for beginners. And always remember that you cannot do anything inside the master. You can only write the title um, page box here and some other things you can do but th these are the basics obviously and then you go straight to the page here uh, you want to bring it into center click click the uh, alt key and bring over with the hand here little hand and you can move it around uh, up and down it's very very simple and that's how you work the basic workings of a master page in Quark Express